Welcome to Electron Online and to, now we're going to look at polarization. And polarization can be accomplished in several ways. One of them is by using what we call polarizers. Polarizers are devices that allow the electromagnetic radiation to transfer through only in one direction. Now, if we have, let's say, light that comes in with the electric field oscillations going vertically and the polarizers are oriented vertically, then the, then the light has no trouble getting through. It goes right to the polarizer unchanged. But if the electric field oscillations are at an angle relative to the polarizer, then the components perpendicular to the direction of the polarizer will get canceled out, and only the direction, only the components of the electric field oscillations in the same direction as the of the uh, polarizer will make it through. And you can see as the light is rotated more and more, so that the electric field oscillations are perpendicular towards the orientation of the polarizer, less and less of the light will get through, and eventually, if it's completely perpendicular to the direction of the polarizer, none of the light will get through. Now, since electromagnetic radiation is typically a combination of, of oscillations in all the various directions, you can then see that on average, half of the light will get through, and the other half of the light will not get through, which means if we have a polarizer that's directed like this, with the uh, direction of the polarization uh, vertical like that and we have a beam incident a beam of light which is incident and let me use red uh, incident upon the polarizer and let's say that the intensity of the beam of light that is directed towards the polarizer is I sub zero then when it leaves the first polarizer and gets through on the other side the intensity on the other side is only equal to half of the original intensity and that's how polarizers work now in my next examples, I have a few examples lined up, you can see how you can put a multitude of polarizers one after the other at various angles, and then you can see what the intensity looks like after it passed through a series of polarizers. So come back and take a look at the next videos and you see how that works.